Hello again. I've made some progress on my Bionex motor, so I figured I'd give you another update. Show you where I'm sitting now. I've had it apart two or three times now, tracing a uh, one of my wires was bad. So I've been in and out, found that. Now uh, now when I when I rotate it and check for voltage on my signal wires on the hall sensors I'm getting a proper uh, signal back 4 point 4 point whatever voltage on and off just like it should on all three sensors so I'm happy with that now I have all three sensors wired out and I have my phase wires also wired out okay what next um, I can show you Endless Sphere, I owe a lot to Endless Sphere. Here's a little chart uh, on one of their one of their threads right there on uh, sorting out your hall sensor wires. So go this way, go that way, depending on depending on what you're seeing. Anyways, I just went through that, made sure I'm all right. So I uh, switched switched uh, phase wires, switched hall sensors wires until. I got my motor rotation in the right direction and running smooth. So I have a cycle analyst wired up here. You can see I'm sitting at 52.6 volts. I don't have the BMS hooked up yet, so I did check all my cell voltages. They're all close enough, so I'm happy enough. But uh, I'm just going to run it to try this out. Got a little thumb throttle here. Should be able to have a look and see the thumb throttle. So it'll go up and down, and and it wails. Oh, it's on cruise control. That's cool. That was cruise control. You can make cruise control go pretty slow. My mom uses one as an exercise device that my dad built for, her. and she sets the cruise control for about yay fast, and then uh, sits in her armchair and it pedals her gives her some exercise and keeps her legs mobile uh, yeah exercise device anyways this isn't going to be an exercise device this is going to go on that bike so now that I have a running unit I got throttle got my hall sensors working motors rotating in the right direction uh, next thing to do is get my BMS wired into this battery and install it all on the bike so hopefully pretty quick here We'll have another running bicycle. That's all. Thanks for checking out my bike build. I'll see you next time.